What is going on, everybody? This is uh, this is awesome. I want to give you the behind the scenes of Team Swartz. All right, this video is gonna be a lot different. In fact, it's gonna be low quality, so I'm sure the audio is gonna be horrible and visuals will probably be blown out, too bright, especially when I get underneath the softbox and everything. When I show you my new studio, my makeshift amateurish <laughs> studio. <laughs> That being said, welcome to my channel. I'm Sergeant First Class Swartz, your local New York Army National Guard recruiter located here in New York City. And on this channel, I provide a ton of Army basic training tips, recruiting, and other Army related videos. Help people make well informed decisions whether or not the Army or specifically the Army National Guard would be a good fit for them for their reasons and their reasons alone. So, with that being said, without further ado, before I actually get this video started, this is actually a corner of my bedroom. The bedroom's actually pretty good, uh, pretty big. But this was for my daughter when she was a newborn. The crib was here and all that good stuff. So I just blocked it off with my armoire here that I got from Ikea. Oh, and I'm not sponsored from Ikea, Sony, or anything, anyone else. Anything I, I show you in this video, I'm not sponsored. I'm not getting paid from anybody. This is just me showing you behind the scenes and, you know, whatever. Um, so stay with me, okay? So this right here studio foam squares to help dampen the sound and hopefully give me better sound quality not so much here on the cell phone because the internal microphone is horrible but nonetheless these here were actually donated by Dykeman label studios up in the Bronx New York and Sergeant Pichardo when you see this thank you so much brother appreciate you saved me a lot of money with these donations appreciate that so about five years ago when I started my social media here on Team Swartz, I literally started with just my cell phone like I'm filming right now. Uh, eventually I got myself an external mic and all that good stuff and I started you know, editing videos on my iPhone through iMovie and eventually I used an app called Video Leap. So if you invest, I think it's like $60 a year. Everything that I can do on my computer for the most part you could do within Video Leap, the app in iTunes. I don't know if it's on the Android operating system, whatever they call it over there. but Either way, it's an amazing app. You can add B-roll footage, pictures over top of your A-roll, and all that good stuff. You can add sound effects, text, all that good stuff. You can animate the text with, within reason. It's not a fancy editing app or anything, but like, anyway. So back to what we're doing. I'm super excited because the reason why I'm saying that is within the last six months or so, I've been investing in myself. This is something I'm passionate about. I've been growing my Instagram. I'm at like 20, a little over 28,000 now by providing the content that I've been providing here on YouTube. And you know, so I'm, I'm relatively new on YouTube. So if you like my content, please do me a favor, hit that sub, like that video, all that good stuff. Don't be afraid to hit me up in the comment section. I answer every single comment that hits my comment section underneath my videos. But if you have a, if I, if I fail to answer you for some reason, because for some reason I'm not getting all the notifications for all the comments to my YouTube, always hit me up on my Instagram, direct message me, DM me. I answer every single DM. Not one DM, it goes unanswered within a few hours, okay? If it's not instantaneous, but definitely within the hour, I usually respond to all DMs because I'm all over it like white on rice, okay? But with that being said, um, I'm showing you the behind the scenes of my new studio, which I'm really, really excited about. I'm gonna be building my own social media agency. So this is gonna all, everything I'm doing on my YouTube channel and stuff is gonna be part of my portfolio. So my goal, my intent in five to eight years from now, when I retire from the Army National Guard as a recruiter or whatever, wherever my life leads me in the Army National Guard, my intent is to open up my own social media agency slash consulting firm. With that being said, so this here is a, an amateurish studio so with this donation of all these foams here i even have them on the ceiling here right here and right there and on the walls all the way around there's actually one right behind my backdrop right there and i got another panel right here and right here in front of my window i have one of those like velcro sticky things holding them on the wall so i'm not ruining my walls with like nails or anything like that my landlord would kick my booty but with that being said i've now upgraded from my iphone iMovie app and the video leap to this here, which is Final Cut Pro, which is a professional level video editing software program. 
to me it looked like Chinese, so I haven't touched it in like two or three years, but in the last six months I started playing around with it, started doing more serious edits that you could see with the new intro video and stuff like that. But I have a lot of, a lot of ideas, but this is my hobby, this is my passion. I don't get paid to do this stuff, and I'm not going to school for it yet, but I am going to be going to college for it, getting my four year degree, thanks to the Army National Guard. Post University is giving me 52 transfer military credits into college credits. Thank you so much, Connecticut, appreciate you, love you. But with that being said, yeah, so this is my editing software. This is a, a big ass monitor. This is a MacBook Pro to where I edit my videos. In fact, uh, this video is a, a test because I just set up these uh, soft box behind me. I got one above me for my hairline. I got my, my, my main light right here. I think they call that the key light. I'm not a professional. I'm an entry level amateur person, so I'm learning as I go. But with that being said, I actually am learning how to edit off of Final Cut Pro here off of my hard drive. So to me, that was awesome because these, this, these, this 4,000 high definition videos at 100 megabytes per second takes up a lot of, a lot of space and it bogs down the computer and it crashes and all that stuff. So yeah, man, thanks to Apple when I was on there uh, fixing my computer, he showed me how to do that. So I don't want to bore you with that, but either way. So this is my studio right here it's where the magic happens like i said it's my softbox one up here i got one in front of me right here and again i'm not monetized i'm not sponsored by anybody but i've upgraded from my iphone xs to this a6400 mirrorless camera i got the sony g oss lens from 18 millimeter to 105 which has an internal zoom which is amazing so it's a good all-around video lens and like i'm just starting out so it's a great uh, entry-level lens for me i actually have a a green screen here i'm going to be filming a a video for the college first program that the army national guard kicked out uh, about a month or two ago they're not advertising it because it's not a nationwide program the state's tag has to opt in for it in the new york army national guard tag general shields he just opted into it about a month ago so i'm going to be doing a video on that stay tuned to that because that's going to be pretty interesting the beginning part of the video the hook it's going to be well in my opinion i mean all my stuff i love but either way it's going to be funny it's going to be awesome it's going to it's gonna be very, very informative, so look out for that video. But uh, I have a Rode mic here for better audio, and I actually recently learned, whoa, it's blowing out, learned how to edit audio. So hopefully my audio and my videos will get better, so I apologize for the for the uh, lack of quality in audio. Uh, but hopefully my visuals are getting better. I'm learning how to color correct and color grade, worry about white balance and all that good stuff. So learning curve, but either way, lots of fun. Again, this is my back backdrop. Yeah, I'm definitely blowing out, but uh, whatever. With these lights, I can't, uh, I can't dim them. But the polarizer that I have there on my on my lens that helps diffuse that stuff. Whatever. I don't want to get all scientific on it. But either way, so this is my makeshift studio. Hope you like the the behind the scenes of what the Army National or what I do here in the Army National Guard as a hobby. But again, my full time job is a recruiter, so. Depending on my free time will dictate how much content I'm able to pump out. Um, but if you do watch my videos, I really do appreciate you watching my videos and liking them and commenting on them and all the good stuff that boosts up the algorithm, spreads out the message, but do appreciate you. And again, I will you know, keep pumping out videos for you. And if you have any ideas, whatever, put them in the comment section below. If and when I do those videos, I will give you the shout out at the end of that video. So if you don't know what time it is, it is time to do nothing but to dominate your day. Thank you so much and I'll see you next time. That's it, video's over, sorry. Um, but you can definitely watch more. You can check out this video here or maybe you can check out this video here. Um, but you know what, actually, this video is pretty good. You, you should definitely watch this one. But actually, this one seems pretty great. You should definitely check out this video. But actually, why don't you watch them both? Try clicking the both.